What is going on everybody? My name is Hi Def Dan and welcome to a new video. Um, recently, as of yesterday, my uh, <clears throat> Ironside Caffeine uh, Dip Review video has uh, become the most popular video on my channel. That it's incredible because the most popular video on my channel had been the dare of me eating chalk and it had been that video for nine years it took nine years and a caffeine dip review <laughs> to get another banger video so today we have another review and uh, full disclosure if what I'm about to review I don't think tastes fresh I don't think tastes nice I'm going to uh, order another one and try again because I've had this one for a while and I haven't done anything with it but today we are reviewing something that I have talked about doing for a while and that is Outlaw's uh, nicotine free dip now last time I had an Outlaw dip it had nicotine in it and it was the Ramblin' Root Beer I'm going to say full disclosure right now I was a big fan of Ramble and Root Beer, I just wasn't a fan of how hard the nicotine kicked me in the ass because I'm not used to it. So, uh, yeah. As far as I know, <clears throat> uh, Outlaw doesn't do nicotine dips anymore. I went to his website, actually, and I'm pretty sure I saw menu items for, uh, like, caffeine dip, too. So if Outlaw has caffeine dip, I might try that. And we already have another, um... Alternative another alternative lined up. I hope you guys like the outfit today nice flannel jacket camel hat I Felt like dressing up kind of for this this one, I guess but um, yeah Also, we got some big news uh, big news coming for the channel very soon. Uh, I've been posting about it on Twitter I'm not gonna make a video about it right now um, just <clears throat> Essentially Within the next month, everything is going to look different behind there. As in, I'm going to be somewhere else. Um, but yeah, so uh, let's get into it. So I think so far for reviews, we have done um, Canada Dips, which I gave, I think, an 8. Uh, back Off, which I gave overall, I think, like a 4. I, I was not a huge fan of the Back Off. I was not... Nothing, like, it tasted like shit my own opinion might taste great to you I personally didn't like it uh, Ironside I think I gave a 6 or a 7 um, and we're going to try different flavors of those as well but um, I just wanted to get like a baseline so I've already tried the Ramblin' Root Beer for Outlaw so now we are going to try Killer Vanilla uh, oh no that's still Real fresh, uh, nicotine free, good looking stuff here. See if I can get it to focus better. Ugh. Not, not bad. Yeah, uh, yeah. Just random cup sitting here is gonna be my spitting cup, which I'm pretty sure you don't need to spit with this stuff because it's uh, nicotine free. Nicotine, tobacco free, nicotine free, killer vanilla. So I'm not so sure. I'm not sure what I'm expecting with this one, but um, I'm rambling on, trying to <laughs> honestly trying to get a, a good couple minutes in uh, for the review. So I fully expect a strong vanilla, maybe a little bit of a burn just to simulate the having um, nicotine. Or tobacco dip in the lip probably gonna have a little bit of simulated burn um, but yeah so we're gonna get into it now and we are going to go ahead and grab a pinch and see how well it pinches um, been been a fan been a fan of uh, outlaw as a whole for a while now and uh, always wanted to try his his dip and I, I don't I'm not shitting on um, nicotine dip I do enjoy nicotine dip every now and then it's just oh this pinch is weird 
This is not pinch how I remember his dip pinching. There you go. We've got ourselves a decent pinch here. It's falling all over the place, so let's just uh, get it going. Wow. You know? You know something? I took a pretty fat pinch on that one. This straight up tastes like vanilla ice cream. You know what? It tastes like ice cream sandwich. It tastes like an ice cream sandwich. It's really nice. It's subtle. I I kind of struggled. I kind of struggled to get a good pinch out of it. But um, once I have it packed in, it sits in there really nicely. I'm getting a real good fucking flavor out of this. And... Uh, Wow, now I don't know what they do to uh, get it to taste exactly like vanilla or with the root beer tastes exactly like root beer, but this one, I cannot believe I have waited like two years to review this. Wow, this is some really good, and the flavor is not fading either. Like, with back off, it faded very quick. With the can of dips, it kind of... It, it came in, it punched you, and it went away. The iron side... The flavor was there, but the flavor was very mellow. It didn't last all that long. But, it did what it advertised. It caffeinated me. I felt the weight. This, that, and the other thing. Whatever. This? There's nothing. It, it's not meant to caffeinate me. It's, it's just meant to simulate... The flavor... Of dip simulate having dip in my lip it is doing that it tastes amazing every time as i'm talking to you it's releasing vanilla flavors like i'm not i'm not saying all this just because i'm a fan of outlaw but it literally just tastes like vanilla sandwich uh an ice cream sandwich holy shit <laughs> it was good i've had this sitting on top of my microwave for a month and a half probably And uh, once I get used to nicotine, I would love to do nicotine uh, dip reviews. And I, if it's f anything flavored like that, perfect. I love it. I'm having a good time with this. Uh, I'm going to spit it now. And uh, we'll come back. Yeah, I did not. I really did not expect that to be as good as it was. That was a very strong, very intense flavor. And when I say by ice cream sandwich, I mean the generic chocolate graham cracker, ice cream chocolate graham cracker. Because that is my favorite treat, my one of my favorite like snacks, my favorite sweets is just a normal ass ice cream sandwich. And that tasted exactly like an ice cream sandwich. I don't know why it tasted like an ice cream sandwich to me, but it did. And uh, that gives it points. So, um, I'm definitely going to go throughout, probably throughout the whole product skew of Outlaw. Uh, he just released a Christmas flavor, which is like a salted caramel, I think it was, or something like that. Uh, I want to get that, but it's $25. But, holy shit, Outlaw Dip really just, uh, really surprised me. Now, it's been a couple years, and... The Canada Dips has been the highest rated dip review I have done. And I think I did Canada Dips 2 almost 3 years ago. Which I gave an 8. Or I gave a 7 or an 8, right? I'm trying to be very strict with my ratings. Canada Dips was a 7 or an 8. Uh, back off was really low for me. Uh, Ironside was pretty good. I think Ironside was a 6. Ironside is the second highest rated. Or, now in this case, the third highest rated. Because my number one dip alternative that I've done is the Outlaw Killer Vanilla. Which I am going to give... Let's talk about it. Let's talk about it. The pinch. It, it I struggled to pinch it a little bit. It, it seemed like it like when I had the Outlaw Nicotine Dip, the Ramblin' Root Beer, it pinched very well. It was easy to manage and... This wasn't. This wasn't as easy. It's still pinched. 
decent. I got a good pinch out of it, you saw on camera. It just wasn't as easy to handle. Uh, but once I got it packed in my lips, it stayed there really well. I just like to mess with it. That's how I do it. Um, it stayed there very well. It, re it released a lot of flavor really quickly, and it, it was a strong flavor that gave me very ice cream sandwich vibes um and i'm gonna add to this video because i'm gonna i have to go to work in a little bit so i'm gonna stop i'll buy an ice cream sandwich and i'll compare but right now it pinched very well the flavor was nice it lasted the entire time whereas uh candy dips kind of wore wore off not it didn't wear off very quickly it took a bit to come in and then it took about double the time it took to come in to wear off um back off just even the coffee for back off the tea for back off it just it didn't do it for me some of the flavor was some of the, some of it had good flavor and most of it did not uh iron side i got the chocolate tundra flavored iron side and that oh boy was that very good this beat everything so whereas the past three dip reviews in order from first to now are like a seven a four and a six on my scale i give the outlaw nicotine free uh killer vanilla a nine okay uh so i said i was gonna add a part involving the ice cream sandwich because I was convinced that the outlaw dip tasted like an ice cream sandwich so I went and bought one and the only one they had is this little tiny one but we're gonna give this a try and we're gonna compare it to the outlaw dip which I still have the flavor fresh in my uh, mind that's it It legitimately tastes just like this ice cream sandwich. That's kind of kind of insane. It legitimately tastes exactly like this ice cream sandwich. So you know what? I'm gonna uh, yeah, I'm gonna stick with my rating of nine for Outlaw. Outlaw's the king right now. It legitimately tastes exactly like this ice cream sandwich, and it has finally dethroned candidates. Um, I do have, uh, I think it was Black Buffalo, I think, it is uh, recommended that came up on my Facebook, something like that, which is an alternative, which I am going, is going to be the next review, uh, but thank you guys for watching, if you have any um, alternatives, nicotine free, tobacco free alternatives, uh, please leave them down in the comments, uh, also be sure to check in the description there will be a link to my twitter my twitch my instagram and my discord and you can go follow on all those i stream usually during the weekends on twitch but i'm also trying to uh, be able to get up early enough to stream during the week on twitch uh there's not going to be any streams this weekend obviously christmas weekend uh but i might try to stream on thursday because that's my birthday but uh thursday the 22nd but Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm probably going to edit and upload this video once I get home, which will be the early morning hours of December 21st. So uh, be on the lookout for that. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you enjoyed my outfit for the video. And I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye.